this, this is the next one. This is Wrecker. And no, he has nothing to do with the Wreckers from Transformers 3. This is Wrecker, a tank. That'd be kind of obvious with the big tank. Anyways, um, I, I really like this guy, this guy a lot because his colors match up very nicely. He looks really cool. And he's got, I love the treads here. And the barrel moves. It gets better. The back is really flush here. The front looks extremely cool. Yeah. Um. The turret does rotate. 360. Um. Whoops. Yeah, the head popped off again. And the, uh, that's why he's not first place. He's quite fragile. Um, you can flip up his head, which is like a hatch, I guess. Um, he's quite fragile, which is why he's not first place. Because everything pops off on him. The treads, the head, these pieces sometimes, the turret, although it's supposed to. Um, so, yeah. I love the treads though, the treads look awesome. Anyways, to, there's not really much to say about him other than that he attacked. To a size comparison, since he's quite small. Here he is, next to Bumblebee. Again, quite small. And to transform him, you want to take off his cannon, which I want to flip up these just to get them out of the way for now. So then you want to flip up the head. So he's like this. Uh, and then you take these black pieces at the back, bring them out, and rotate around. And those will become the feet. And as you just saw, these pieces pop up again and again and again. Anyways, you want to flip up these parts here. Then you bring these pieces down. And yeah, he will pop off. And they do like to pop off. I don't know why, but they do. Then you just kind of 